The biggest hole in their game was the big man. The main difference, I believe, between basketball as played by the National Basketball Association and the American Basketball Association now is purely one of size. We do not have the superstar big seven-foot center. The ABA came along and says, well, we don't have Bill Russell and we don't have Wilt Chamberlain. And we don't have the superstar six-foot-six and six-foot-seven-inch guards. How are we going to solve this ABA problem? Remember, it's only in the ABA that you get an extra point for sinking that long shot making for some exciting dead-eye shooting in clutch situations. Move the ball, uh, take the break. I mean, there were many a time coming down the floor, Slick would be yelling at me, you know, take the three, Billy, pull up and shoot the three. The ABA feels that this extra incentive to shoot from farther out causes the defense to open up. That opened up the defenses, so now you could drive from the wings and get under the defenses, and there was more action. Create a more exciting game for the fans. Give the team that's behind an opportunity to close the gap quickly with long three-point shots. Give the little man more of a chance to balance up his value in the game compared to the big man. The ABA soon became a shooter's paradise. Among the best were Kentucky's Darryl Carrier and Billy Keller of the Indiana Pacers. But the master of the three-point shot was the league's all-time leading scorer, Louis Dampier, who played all nine seasons with the Kentucky Colonels. I shot 500 one year, or maybe more, and hit almost 200 a couple years in a row. We would come down on a two-on-one fast break. He's running to the corner to shoot a three on a two-on-one fast break. Now, when you see that for the first time, and you're a purist, you're not very happy with his shot selection. While the three-point shot and red, white, and blue ball defined the ABA, both innovations irritated the NBA. The company line was that the new league was making a mockery of the sport. 